To write the Lewis structure for BrCl2-, we'll first count up the valence electrons. Bromine, that's in group 17, sometimes called 7A, seven valence electrons. Chlorine is in the same group. It has seven valence electrons as well, but we have two chlorines. Multiply that by two, plus this negative sign, that means we have an extra electron. So we'll add that on there. We have 14, 15, plus seven, 22 total valence electrons for the BrCl2 minus Lewis structure. We'll put bromine in the center, and then we'll put chlorine atoms on either side. Next, we're going to take and put electrons between the atoms. That'll show the chemical bond there. So we'll put a pair of electrons here. Now the bromine and the chlorine are bonded, and we'll put a pair right here. After that, we'll go around each one of the atoms and complete the octet. So far, we've used 16 valence electrons. So let's complete the octet on the bromine here in the center. And now we've used 20 valence electrons, but we said we had 22. So what we can do, bromine can have an expanded octet. So we could squeeze in another pair of electrons right here, and that would have us use up all our electrons, and we would have octets for the chlorine. And bromine, that can have an expanded octet, so that's okay as well. But how do we know that we put the extra electron pair on the bromine and not the chlorine? To figure that out, we calculate the formal charges. If we calculate the formal charges here, with the extra pair of electrons here in the bromine, we get a minus one on the bromine, and then these chlorines, they have formal charges of zero. So that's pretty good. If we had the extra pair of electrons on one of the chlorines, that would cause problems. It wouldn't be as close to zero as we have it here. So this is the best Lewis structure for BrCl2 minus. We should also though put brackets around it to show that it's an ion and then add the negative charge. Put our negative charge up here. And that's the Lewis structure for BrCl2 minus. A little bit of a complicated one. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.